Hello everyone, how are you today? Welcome to the YouTube channel Plantastic. Alright, if you don't know about plant tissue culture, you may refer to previous video. If you're going to about set out the facilities, you can refer to another video. Today, I'm going to teach you how to prepare the media step by step. What is media? Media is the artificial nutrients that supply the nutrients to the in vitro plants. It can be optimized based on the different plants and stages. How do we prepare a good media? First, we have to prepare the stock solutions. Then from there, we prepare the working solutions. The major components of the media are sugar, which mainly sucrose, stock solutions, distilled water, gelling agent. Where do I get the list of the chemical composition? The chemical compositions of the media, you can get it easily by searching the chemical composition of certain media. For example, I will show you the Murashige and Scoop media here. How do we prepare a stock solution? First, you have to refer to the list of the chemical compositions. You have to get the chemicals prepared. It can be Murashige and Scoop 1962 media, which is known as MS, or Woody Plant Medium, WPM. White medium, Gambok B5 medium, etc. MS media is known as a universal media. So in this video, we are going to show you how to prepare a stock solution based on MS media. For stock solution, basically I will prepare in macro solutions, micro solution, vitamin solution, and also iron. For stock solution preparation, first, you have to get the chemical salts ready. And then we have to calculate the amount of the salts needed to be prepared for the desired concentrations of the stock solutions. For example, here, the stock solution that we are going to prepare is ammonium nitrate, NH4 and O3. For one liter of working solution, which is one time in the table here, 1650 milligram per liter is needed for one time. So we convert it into gram per liter, which means that for one liter, we need only 1.65 gram of the ammonium nitrate. So we prepare it at a higher concentration, which is 100 times. So we times 100 on 1.65 gram per liter, which will give you the amount of 165 gram per liter. For a liter stock solution at 100 times, 165 gram of the stock is needed. To prepare the stock solution at 500 ml, we need to divide the amount by 2. So in order to prepare 500 ml, you need only 82.5 gram ammonium nitrate. So if you want to prepare 250 ml, you need only 41.25 gram of the ammonium nitrate. Here is a summary of the simplified stock solution operation. You can see here, for ammonium nitrate, we need 1.65 gram per liter, 1.9 gram per liter for potassium nitrate, 0.44 gram per liter for calcium chloride anhydride, 0.37 gram per liter magnesium sulfate anhydride, and 0.17 potassium phosphate monobasic. So for one liter, we need this amount. To prepare 500 ml for each stock solution, you need only 82.5 gram of ammonium nitrate for 500 ml, 95 gram of potassium nitrate for 500 ml, 22 gram of the calcium chloride anhydride for 500 ml, 18.5 gram of magnesium sulfate anhydride for 500 ml, 8.5 gram of potassium phosphate monobasic for 500 ml. So, if you found the concentration is too high for you, you may prepare at 50 times with the same method. Stock solution is prepared separately to prevent the precipitation. For micronutrients, you can mix all the micronutrients in one bottle. For vitamin as well. For iron ethylene diamine tetraacetate, you need it is needed to be prepared in separately with aluminum foil or keep in the dark reagent bottle. Alright, we already prepared the stock solution. So now we need to prepare the working solution from the stock solution. 
From there, we need to dilute the stock solution to prepare the working solution. Alright, to prepare the working solution, we need to use the dilution formula, which is M1V1 equals to M2V2. 1 is indicated as the stock. 2 is indication of the working solution. So we substitute the concentration of the stock solution into M1. The working solution we use is one time. If we are going to prepare 1 liter, we just write 1000 ml here. So the volume needed from the stock solution will be 10 ml after the calculation. Therefore, in order to prepare 1 liter of media, you need to pipette 10 ml of each stock solution in the concentration of 100 times into the beaker. Here is the overflow of the media preparation. Stage 0. Preparation of stock solution, followed by the dilution from stock solution. For the working solution, you need to add the sucrose and gel as well. After pH measurement, you can dissolve the air guide by using microwave. We dispense the media in each container and we sterilize it. Remember, the container must be heat tolerant as well as the lid of the container. Alright, let's prepare the media stage by stage. First, for the stock solution preparation. What is stock solution? Stock solution is the concentrated solution. It can be prepared in 10, 20, 50, or even 100 times. For a macro stock solutions, they are recommended to be prepared in individual bottles, which means that for macro solutions, you will have 5 bottles to prevent precipitation. For micro and vitamin stock solution, there will be another 2 individual bottles. For iron stock solution, it needed to be in dark reagent bottle or the bottle wrapped with aluminium foil to prevent photo oxidation. So total here will be 5 plus 2 plus 1. Total here will be 8 bottles. Stage 1 of the media preparation, which is the dilution of stock solution. The exact amount needed was calculated using dilution formula and what we want equals to M2V2. And then the desired amount will be pipetted into the 1 liter picker if you are going to prepare 1 liter. The next stage is the addition of sucrose and jowling agent. We will add the desired amount of sugar. Most likely, we will use 30 gram per liter. Sucrose, was the, sucrose is the commonly used sugar in plant tissue culture. This is because after the sterilization process, the sucrose will undergo hydrolysis process in which it will break down into glucose and fructose. And then the glucose will be used as the building material for the plant. If you are going to use the glucose, it might have lower concentration after the sterilization process due to the breaking down of the glucose at high temperature. Most of the studies was found that sucrose is the best sugar among all the sugars. However, you can test with other sugar. For home base, you can use the table sugar that you bought that is available at the grocery. The difference is just the purity of the table sugar and the lab graded sucrose. Next, we will add the desired amount of gelling agent such as the agar powder. You will have to wait accordingly to the factory of the production, which is labeled on the bottle itself. For home base, you can use the agar powder available at the grocery as well. After that, we top up the volume with distilled water to around 950 ml and stir until all are dissolved. If you are going to prepare one liter media for this. For me, if you are going to prepare 1000, I always minus 50. If you are going to prepare 500 ml, I always minus 50 as well. Which means that if you are going to prepare 500 ml, we only top up to 450. We are not going to top up until the desired amount. This is because we have to do some pH measurement. After all the chemicals are dissolved, we adjust the pH to the desired pH, which commonly in the range of 5.7 to 5.8. The adjustment is done by using 1.0 normality of the hydrochloric acid or sodium hydroxide. NaOH. Finally, after the adjustment is done, we top up to 1 liter using distilled water. The last stage, 
we microwave the solution until the agar is dissolved and boiled. We dispense the stir solution into the heat tolerant containers. Then we close the container with the heat tolerant lids. After that, we sterilize them using autoclave at 121 degrees Celsius for 15 minutes. What else can be done from here? The previous steps was referring the basal media, which is the media without any extra supplements in the media. Supplementations such as the plant growth regulator PGR, activated charcoal, antioxidants, organic additives such as banana, potato can be added into the media. The optimization of the media is needed to be conducted to optimize the maximal output. Besides that, there is commercial premixed media powder in which you can prepare the media in faster way, which is less tedious if you want to skip the preparation of stock solution. But the disadvantage is it is high cost. There are some precautions here. You have to wipe off any residue of the media that found on the mouth of the container during the pouring process. This is because if you didn't wipe it off, during the storing process, it might have fungus grow at the mouth of container. Before you use the media, I suggest you to keep the sterilized media for 3 to 5 days to double confirm prior to the aseptic inoculation. This is because sometimes the lid might loosen during the heating process in the sterilization. So, some of the lid might expose to the air without your notice. Alright, we are about to end our video here. Don't forget to subscribe, share and hit up the notification button for subsequent videos on plant science. You may also find me at the LinkedIn profile for the connection. This is not a sponsored video and I would like to share with every one of you the reference I used in this video. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.